Right, you guys got another video here for you a new look for windows 11 in 2022 microsoft have released a new windows theme to celebrate the panatone color of the year 2022 if we take a look inside the personalization settings here for our windows 11 system you'll see a bunch of themes in here which are installed by default but if you want to get this new panatone uh, color theme released from Microsoft then I'll show you basically how to do it it's pretty straightforward and easy to do you can get it from the Microsoft store or you can click on browse themes this will take you to the Microsoft store where all the themes are located and you can use any of these listed in here now if you want to find the Panatone uh, color theme then all you need to do is go up to the search box here and you can type in here Panatone and basically that will then find the Panatone theme released by Microsoft. So let me go ahead and do that. You can see it coming up here, Panatone color of the year 2022. Once you do this, you can then click on the get, and this will allow you to get the actual theme from Microsoft. Now, for those who are unfamiliar with the Panatone, the company is renowned for its industry leading color matching technology and its color of the year 2022 is now available through Windows, Microsoft Edge, Microsoft Teams, and PowerPoint. Now, Panatone describes its color of the year 2022 as a dynamic periwinkle blue hue with a vivifying violet and red undertone. Microsoft used the new color to craft their new Windows theme. So now we're going to go and activate this theme by clicking on it, and you can see it here, it's changed the wallpaper, now, to change all of the other taskbar colors and start menu uh, colors, we can do that also in this theme as well. And I'll quickly show you how to do that as well. But I do actually like the look of this. It's a nice sort of dark theme look. Now, if we look at the very top here, you'll see a color indigo. We can click on this and this will give us access to the personalization pane for this theme. We can see it's set to dark. And there's also some other settings inside here, like your transparency effect. And also we have our accent colors, which is set to manual because this is what the theme is using. And you can see it's set to purple here. Now coming down a little bit further here, you can customize the colors. And you can also show accent color on the start and taskbar here. If you toggle this on, it will change that color here. So let me just show you here. There we go. That should change the color here, as you can see, to the actual theme color. And the start menu has now been changed as well. Now, if you want to show accents color on the title bars and window borders, then you can do this by toggling this one on here. And this will give you a little accent color around the title bars and window borders. As you can see here on the browser, it's give us a nice little title bar color. And again, that will change it all across the Windows platform for all your title bars and things like that. So that is the Panatone uh, color theme for Windows 11. We have also the related theme settings down here as well, which is your contrast and other things like that as well, which you can mess around with if you wish. I just tend to leave that alone. But that is basically all of your settings inside here. You've got your themes and also all your other settings in there. So get it downloaded and get it installed. It's quite a nice new look for 2022 for Windows 11. I do think that's probably the best theme that Windows 11 has got on there so far. So a pretty nice uh, refreshing look for 2022. Anyway, that's going to be about it for this video. Just a really quick and simple video for today. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Hope you enjoy the videos and I hope you're enjoying your Christmas holidays. And I will see you again for another video real soon. Just want to say a big shout out to all my YouTube members who have joined my YouTube members group and showing the support. I really do appreciate it. Your names are rolling up on the screen right now. I shall see you again real soon. Bye for now.